Hey guys, alright, so I'm here today with my November haul. So as you guys know, last month I said I'm not going to shop that much because I'm going to have some life changes maybe coming up. So I have stuck to that and for everyone that thought I was pregnant or getting married, I am not doing either of those things. So don't worry about that guys. So anyway, I'm just going to get into this. So um, I brought this dress which you guys have seen in my previous um, spring summer essentials video so um this i pretty much just got off this trading facebook site because these were these are kind of old season and i saw one of the girls in glassons wearing one of these and i was like oh my god i need that dress and i asked her about it and she pretty much told me that they were sold out like nationwide and ever since then i've just been craving this dress so when i saw this girl like um, selling it online I was like oh my god I have to buy it so I know that these were originally only like $40 retail price but I picked mine up for $35 because I was like hell no I'm not gonna let anyone outbid me on buying this dress so I bought it and I love it so that is that um also went to cotton on the outlet store in Manukau uh, maybe a month ago or something and I picked up this kind of chiffon throw it's kind of kimono like and this was only five dollars and super versatile for summer you're gonna chuck it on your swimsuits or just cut off shorts in the top and you're good to go and the other thing that i bought was this rose gold knit so it's like a metallic knit from uh cut it on as well and this was only ten dollars so i picked it up even though it's in a size kind of too big for me because they originally retailed for like sixty dollars or something so they're only ten dollars and i was like oh <gasps> buying it because I have no self-control as you guys can see so yeah the last kind of accessory thing that I really bought was this studded clutch from Doshi which you guys have seen again in my spring summer's essential video and um seriously this is so badass like the camera doesn't just pick up on how cool this is it's so cool I love it so um yeah doubles as a bag and also as a clutch because you can take it off the little hooky thing so yeah that was $50 if I said from Dottie and I just love this so that was that um if you guys follow me on Instagram you would have seen me kind of put up a picture of all this makeup and I spent way too much at this makeup sale it was some L'Oreal kind of makeup sale but they had lots of different kind of brands there as well and it was kind of like a I don't even know it's like an invite only thing I got some tickets from this guy that used to work at L'Oreal so I was pretty stoked about that so I'm not going to go through everything that I bought just because as I said a lot of it I am giving away to people I'm not keeping everything so um yeah I'm just going to go through the kind of a few things that I'm keeping myself so the first thing is this YSL nail polish so this is in the color rich coffee and it is on my nails right now excuse my really really chipped nails I just get really lazy with redoing my nail polish but this was only ten dollars so I was like steal and I got that I also got the YSL mascara as well and just because I love mascara and I need to use mascara and it just came with a free kind of eye makeup remover um yeah little thing and that was $30 and the last thing I got was the YSL Touche Cla. so this is just kind of like a highlighter slash illuminator and I love like the YSL packaging I just think it's so pretty it's like gold and just Makes you feel luxurious, but um, yeah, this is in the color kind of rose, the rose color, I think. So this is just like an illuminator which you put under your eyes or on the arch of your nose and things like that. And um, if I didn't say this was $30. And the very last thing that I got was this Kerastase um, Oleo Relax Nui. I don't know. It's like this, it's pretty much essentially crap you put in your hair at night time to make it feel nice the next day. So I've only used this a few times, but it actually really does work quite well. And because I get really really knotty hair as well so it's been it's proving to be quite good and this was $15 on sale as well now yeah also since I love all of you guys do um there will be a giveaway coming soon just kind of like a Christmas giveaway or whatever and I've just got a lot of kind of makeup stuff that I picked up from the sale that I want to give to you guys as well but I'm gonna go out and kind of buy a few more like accessories and stuff like that because I know essentially I am a fashion channel so um I wouldn't be complete without some kind of more accessories kind of bracelets things like that but I also need to figure out whether or not I can actually send nail polish to different countries because I'm pretty sure there's some cray cray bad about not being able to send nail polish but um yeah that's that also 
I know I haven't really spent that much in clothing, but yeah, my makeup I spent way too much. And then I needed to get glasses because my prescription has changed like dramatically and I've been having like trouble driving at night and stuff. So I went to the Toronto store and I needed new glasses. So I got um, a new pair of glasses and you have seen these in my latest video. Anyway, and this is what they look like. I'm actually wearing contacts right now, so this feels really weird. But um, yeah, these were $170 and they're what I feel like kind of hipster slash nerdy glasses so I thought that was really cool it was funny because when I went to the optometrist um, she pretty much like freaked out and she's like oh my god you can't drive at night time tonight you're not gonna be able to drive I'm gonna have to give you a new pair of contacts so you can wear these until we get your glasses like um, prescribed properly and she was just freaking out and I was just like chill out lady I can still see if I squint really hard and she was yeah she was not impressed but um yeah so I got a, a new pair of glasses and then I also got my old glasses relensed as well and boy oh boy do optometrists like to rip you off so I spent like 300 and something getting my glasses um up to my current prescription and then I have to get contact soon as well yay the joys of being blind so yeah, anyway, rant over. Next thing is I've been really, really into kind of home decor lately. So I love going into like home decor stores, which I think is a telltale sign that I'm getting old because I remember when my mum used to take me into like stores like this and I used to just be like, oh my God, mum, when can we leave? I'm so bored. This is so boring. And now I'm just in love with things like that. So I love decorating and I love like kind of interior design. So anyway, tangent again, but I went to the warehouse the other day and I picked up this throw and oh my God, it is so freaking soft. You have no idea. Like I could literally just touch this all day. It's so nice. Huh. I could do the rest of this video just stroking this, but I think you guys would be a little bit creeped out and I try not to creep you guys out most of the time, but oh my god, this is so so soft and this is so nice and so nice to sleep on and it's just amazing and yeah. Okay, before I just rave on and on about this, this was $15 on sale at the warehouse and it was originally $36, so that's that. And then if you guys follow me on Instagram, you guys will also have seen this already, but um, these are just kind of more of the DIY projects that sometimes I like to do. So um, if you guys follow me on Twitter you'll see I kind of tweeted a while back that I really loved the Prada sign in the Gossip Girl house, the Van Der house, and I've just been obsessed with it and I tried to find one on eBay or like you know online sites that were cheap but they were like 500 US dollars for like that print, that canvas print and I was like hell no am I paying that for like that kind of stuff. So I went ahead and made my own so that is pretty much what it turned out to be like. It's just a really, really small one. But um, yeah, it's the Prada side and this um, frame was only $3.90. Typical, my battery's running out again, so I'm just going to speed through this. So yeah, that was that one. And just picked up that frame from the three, two, one, two, three dollar shop. Even though that was $3.90, they lie about their prices. And I also just picked up a sign that says... But actually, I wrote their own sign. It was my own blackboard. I bought a blackboard. Yeah, so it says, forget all the reasons why it won't work and believe the one reason why it will work. Or why it will. So um, that was $3.90 as well. So um, yeah, that was my haul. So I hope you guys liked this. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.